We're here with Cody Cromwell and Brandon Smalling after Earl in Baseball uh, season opening sweep of Sewanee 8 0 in game one and then a come from behind 6 5 win in game two. Uh, Cody, catcher in game one, caught Howie Smith seven shutout innings and Dalton Carter finished out the shutout there. Also, three of four in that first game. Talk about your performance. Uh, well, first, it was a strong showing by Howie Smith. He dictated the counts. He was getting ahead, getting uh, throwing a lot of strikes, um, basically just shoving and Personally, the bat felt well, or felt good, and I was swinging it well. So, and Brandon, you also finished two of three in that first game. Talk about your performance. Uh, you know, don't try to do too much. That's uh, what Coach JV always tells us. And I uh, came away with two singles uh, to help my team. Uh, started off with the first first run to get our team going. Led to eight. And then in that second game, uh, trailing 5 nothing, came come from behind to win 6-5, but you guys both played a pretty integral part in that ninth inning. Cody drawing an opening walk, and... Uh, scoring the game tying run on that wild pitch. Walk us through that moment. Uh, well, I had Coach uh, BP right behind me, right in my ear. I heard him say yes. Was, I didn't really know what he said, but I just reacted and took off the home and did a swim slide. Yep, got right out of the tag, and then Brandon uh, was, following up the at-bat next with a game-winning RBI there towards third baseman. How does that feel? It was funny when he was sliding into home. I wasn't telling him to come because the ball didn't break enough, but he slid in there in just enough time. Um, after the game was tied up, there was no pressure. Uh, Laird had worked his way to third base. Uh, you can't lose. You just got to put the ball in play. I had two strikes on me. and uh, Full count, I was able to put the ball in play. and uh, The guy dove for it and bobbled it, able to get a run out of it, help my team take the lead.